The helmets and cleats have been pulled out of the closet in hundreds of high school athletes around the panhandle. They hit the field today for the first time this calendar year. Spring football has arrived. The defending Bay County champions are one of many back in action. The Bay Tornadoes are coming off a historic eight win season where they won their first county and district title in the same season since 2004. Back at the helm for his second year at Bay is head coach Jeremy Brown with a lot of confidence in his bunch. The Tornadoes are graduating a massive senior class, nearly two dozen players, much of their starting lineup and several college signees. Brown says spring is all about starting fresh and his team isn't looking back. For three weeks, you're not really worried about who you're playing. You're just worrying about Bay High. You're worrying about getting better. You know, you've you got some guys that, some JV guys that you're hoping to, you know, they're hoping that they're ready to perform at the varsity level. You got some, some varsity guys that were special teams guys last year. They were role players. And now this year, we're going to put them in leadership roles. They're going to be on the field a lot. In year one under Brown, the Tornadoes' motto was restore the red, meaning to take pride in representing and cheering on Bay High. He says they accomplished that goal last fall, and now it's time to build off that foundation. We, we feel like we've laid the concrete, you know what I mean? But if we go, if we go build our walls with paper mache, it's not going to last. And so we gotta, we got to keep adding the right foundation. I think that comes in the culture and, and toughness and, and playing football, really the only way that I – the only way I knew how to play it and the only way I knew how to coach it was just to be tough and to be nasty and to be physical. White scrimmage on May 12th and they'll play their spring game at Tate High School on May 19th.